right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Officer vehicle in need of immediate assistance. Officers needed in Yorkville. Now reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crime. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. The residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Ugh! Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague! Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! You can't treat us Left like Left my animals. stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember... Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Okay, okay, I'm gone. <laughs> I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Wait! <laughs> I like this thing. Turn him around. What was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. 
This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Norman bids his the fabulous Osborne boys. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. It's the combat prototype from the schematic. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms. And a motto. Pax in Bello. Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write up. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um... On a big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days.
This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. July 18. Bingo. Super. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman Osborne. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a, a child's x-ray. But it's not Harry or Emily. Who is this? That aura around him. Is this Martin Lee? Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. Try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath. They're using it. Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Sable troop deployments.
GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh, no. Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. What the hell was that? Control. Breathe clear. Repeat. Breathe clear. Need to clear that balcony. Hey! <gasps> Boss, we got her. No! Pete, you here? Turn it off Lex now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. Hey! 
Okay, you ready? Wait, wait, hold on! It's too late. You're up! You are crazy! You're amazing. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. <laughs>